Today's calm coastline is expected to look a lot different 48 hours from now. With Henri expected to track inland, New Hampshire's coast will be on the windy side of the storm, coinciding with higher than average tides on Sunday and Monday, and that could push a lot of water on shore. The concerns so far for the seacoast area will be the storm surge and the wind. Flood prone areas will be especially vulnerable. Erosion possible in usual spots like the rock seawall at Bass Beach and Rye. The town's highway department and the state DOT already placing road closed signs near problem areas. We've done some pre-staging with some anticipation, what I would call the usual spots where flooding will occur. Where we may have to detour traffic and or close it down to one lane. The Coast Guard warning mariners to take precautions, pull trailerable boats out, check mooring lines, or move vessels to safe harbors. Some fishermen waiting for a clearer sense of Henri's track before they take action. I mean, worst case scenario, you know, you haul out and wait for the storm to pass. Everyone, mariners and residents alike, are urged to monitor conditions and have a plan. We're live in Hampton, Jennifer Crompton, WMUR News 9.